WTFNN. Headline News Update. Welcome, folks, to the 1 p.m. update. Right now, we've got the Dow trading up 49 points, 26,803 is the print. The transports are also up about a quarter of a percent, 21 points. Otherwise, all of the other indices to the downside, nothing significant with the exception being the Russell 2000. That's off 10 points or about six tenths of a percent, half a percent to the downside inside of the uh, semiconductor index. She's trade out at 1413. You've got gold basically flat trade at 1397, silver off 22 pennies, one and a half percent to the downside trading out at 1526 light sweet crude up five percent plus that's up two dollars and 89 cents that can't be right that is the wrong contract let's get the correct contract out there i hate when things roll and that's up 44 cents uh, that is uh, trading out at 57.51. Let's uh, begin by taking a look at the Dow. The key here in the Dow, the key number to be watching today potentially is going to be 26.695. 26.695 for the uh, Dow is the swing point from April 23rd, 2019. If uh, price continues to close above that, uh, well, then uh, what it's likely to do is target its all-time high. Inside the Dow, that number is 26.951. 26951 that takes you back to the October 3rd 2018 level out there what happens if we go back even further yeah that was uh, that October level was above the uh, January so at this stage here no failures inside of the Dow if we take a look at the S&P 500 the S&P 500 trading right now out at 2954 2954 takes you above the swing point uh, I take that. Uh, we're, well, we're trading 29.54.55. 29.54.13 happens to be the swing point out there from May Day. Um, was there a higher high? There was a higher high. Let me see here, folks. I'm just trying to look at the uh, January. I'm sorry, September 21.18. September 21st, 2018, that high was 29.40. No. So uh, the number to be watching here is 29.54.13. If there's a close above that, well, where does that say that price could uh, head to? You know, here's what I would do. Just a simple trend line, folks. A simple trend line. We'll take the high of September 21st and then the high of May Day out there. Let's extend that line to the right. Let's see if we can do it in the next five seconds out here. Extend right. That would be, well, we're trading right into it right now. Hey, folks, stay tuned. I'm Steve Rhodes. I'll be up with the next hour. We'll take a look at these markets in depth. Have a great Friday and a great weekend. Take care.